Japan. Last night I dreamt I was back in Japan, back in the land of the dawn crimson sun. Again we visited the secret valley temple, hidden by thick ancient dark forest. This valley is split by a quick mountain stream, spanned by a tall covered wooden ridge. We climbed the hill, and then wandered the halls, empty quarters echoing to our footsteps. Deep in the temple the wooden Buddha sits, as he has sat for 800 years. Smiling his gift of subtle beneficence, glowing with a soft, kind golden light. The bell tower brings forth the resonant chime, calling to the prayer hall a solitary monk. He chants the sutra in rhythm like a song, in a holy language now dead and forgotten. At the top of the valley, stands the red pagoda, four stories high, a fragile silhouette. Breaking the skyline, where light and profusion, declares the colorful, majestic sunset. Night now has fallen, all over the mountain, the cherry blossoms open to the soft April night. The full moon shines bright illuminating the petals, white as cold snow against far distant stars.